right, let's do some more video. And uh, here we are coming into Clovis. I'm driving uh, still eastbound on Bullard. Listen to that. That's not full throttle, that's just where it shifts. This bus turns pretty tight. It has the non canceling type turn signal switch on it, which is actually better in my opinion because it cancels while you're wriggling the bus around the corner, not when you want it to cancel. So a lot of the bus drivers, a lot of the bus companies disconnect the factory turn signal that every time you move and correct in the lane, the steering wheel cancels the flasher and the amount of the non-canceling kind on the side. This one has one of those. I like it better. Also, I don't have to hunt around the steering wheel for the uh, for the four-way flasher. It's right there on the, on the big handle. I can see it here with one hand. So, I like that. Well, there's a lot of 42 year old cars that don't look as good as this bus and most all of them don't drive as well as this bus does and almost none of them sounds as good as this bus unless somebody builds an engine for it. Just so sweet. I love it. You've heard me say that before. I know I've all over every bus I get. But this one is different. This is a bus that I've heard about. It was a legend in the district for uh, about 25 years uh, they had it. This district didn't exist before that as such. I guess it was, it was in the district that they took over or whatever. I don't know the story. Well, I know is the bus came with it. And uh, they paid 80 grand for this bus in uh, 88 or whatever it was they bought it from the other district. And uh, it's not going to be 80 grand now, but it's, it's not cheap either. I didn't buy it cheap. I've been trying for six, eight months, to, about eight months to buy it. And I finally just did what I had to do because I can't duplicate this bus. I haven't had a 36 foot Allison 671 in stock for so long, I can't remember. I had one that I bought that was, uh, that was sold just about the day I got it. I'm hoping I can keep this one a little longer, but uh, I haven't had one I could drive around in for quite a while. I don't mind the Allison, but I don't like the, st the standard AT, whatever, MT, whatever it is. Or, I forget the number. I don't, the regular transmission that goes behind these old uh, 651s, I don't care for them. But this setup is cool. Watch this. Can I hear that down chip? And then it locks up. I love it. This is a really, really and it locks in second and lock in third. If you're, if you're hard on the throttle, it locks up solid in second. So, so sweet. And it waits in the lower gears until you're, until you're sure you're going to go in the next gear so you're not shifting back and forth all the time. Stays up on the power curve, which the Detroit appreciates. Yeah, I'm having nothing but fun here. Got a long trip home though. I got about uh, almost 400 miles to go home yet tonight. We got to go to a birthday kid for grand, a back birthday party for grandkids first. So it'll be late when I get home, but I'll be smiling all the way. Shocks are nice and tight. No secondary bounds.
Light throttle is a gentleman. Very smooth. Not like driving a normal uh, Allison behind a, a 671. They're uh, jerky and once they go up a gear, they won't go back down unless you have manually downshift them. And they just lug the four engine. There's forever, the engines are struggling with too low an RPM. This one is set up so perfect. Shifts at 2100 RPM, downshifts at about 1800 RPM, 1700 RPM, snap downshift. Nice high stall speed torque converter that locks up in second, about halfway up the RPMs. So it comes off the line like a banshee. Upshift until it until it's supposed to, so it doesn't take you off the power curve. And once it does upshift, if you didn't want it, you just snap the throttle and come right back down. runs faster a half throttle than most 671 Allison's do at full throttle. This bus, the only bus I've ever driven, the only Crown I've ever driven with an Allison that drove like this was that was the old green machine. And this bus will run with the green machine very nicely, thank you. This bus will give you all you ask for when you ask it when you give it throttle. And you need you give it all it needs and it's ready to go. Gotta love it. All right, we're gonna shut it off for now. We'll bring you back more videos as we drive it home.